everybody. My name is Timothy Trespass, and I am a targeted individual. Uh, I wanted to put this on tape before I forget it. If we lived in a society where the powers that be cared that we had happy, healthy, loving, fulfilling lives, then many of the problems we have today would not exist. <sighs> Think about it. Problems with money? We're enslaved to the bankers. We are born into debt slavery and we will die as debt slaves. Most of us don't know it. We're just statutory citizens running in the rat race trying to keep a roof over our head and food in our mouths. But none of this would be possible without complete control of all resources, mainly power. Electricity, oil, anything that makes power. We have uh, combustion engines that are 80% inefficient and 20% efficient. In other words, you buy a gallon of gasoline, 20% of it is making your engine move and making your car go. And the other 80% is getting burned up in the catalytic converter they put on the end of your car to keep that 80% of the hydrocarbon fuel from polluting the world. Sounds a little back-ass to me, but hey, if everybody had free, unlimited power, then we could recycle everything. We could have a system that recycles everything. And that would pretty much stop any kind of complaints about there's not enough this, there's not enough that, because we wouldn't waste it. Right? Uh, pretty much everything we buy is designed to be ineffective, inefficient, meantime before failure, breakdown. So, you know, the food we eat is there to nutrient give us nutrition, sustenance. It's also there to make us sick, fat, stupid, dumb, and dead. Medicine, same deal. It's supposed to make you happy and healthy, right? Well, medicine causes disease. There are people causing disease. All right, let's not get into this. All I'm saying is, if we had a society that cared about the success of every individual in the society and outside of it, we wouldn't have the same problems we'd have today. Targeting wouldn't be necessary. Ah. But, you know, when you stop looking at this in a human perspective and you start looking at it in, in a, in a uh, what's the word, uh, metaphysical, perspective, the afterlife, that other dimension, timeless dimension, well, excuse me, in my opinion, there are way too many major players, you know, big CEOs, almost every corporation that makes stuff that we eat, drink, put on us or in us, around us, is worshipping this number two thing, and uh, that's something we need to change. That's uh, my story, and I'm sticking to it. Just a thought. Thanks for watching. God bless you all.